Brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Hi, I'm Mike from 1AAuto. I hope this how-to video helps you out. And next time you need parts for your vehicle, think of 1AAuto.com. Thanks. In this video, we're going to show you how to replace the axle shift actuator on this 2003 GMC Envoy XL. And the items you need is a new axle shift actuator from 1AAuto.com, an 8 and 19 millimeter socket and ratchet with an extension and a swivel as recommended, a flat blade screwdriver, torque wrench, and jack and jack stands. Start out by removing your wheel and tire, pry off the cap first. Um, if you don't have the benefit of air tools, you'll want to loosen the lug nuts, then raise and secure the vehicle on jack stands and remove the lug nuts the rest of the way. Um, we have air tools, so we put the vehicle up on jack and jack stands, remove the lug nuts, and remove the wheel and tire. On the harness on your shift actuator, just pry this clip down and pull it off. And now you want to pry out on the tab on the harness while prying down with another screwdriver to get the harness free. And it can be a little difficult because sand does get inside there. Okay, so you could get in here with something even as simple as an 8mm wrench. There's two bolts, one on top that hold it, and then one on bottom. The easiest way is a nice long extension, a swivel joint, I've got some tape on it to keep it stiff in an 8mm socket and just undo these bolts and it'll come out. You may have to, once you get the bolts out, you may have to just tap on it a little bit with a hammer just to loosen it up and then it'll come out. Once those two bolts are removed, the actuator just pulls free. And on the right is the old axle shift actuator. On the left is the new one from 1A Auto. You can see they're identical and they'll fit exactly the same. Take your new axle shift actuator and push it into place. And then replace those two 8mm bolts by hand. And then tighten them up the rest of the way with your ratchet and extension. Now reconnect the harness and push that clip back up into place. Replace your wheel and replace the lug nuts and tighten them up preliminarily. Lower the vehicle, tighten them the rest of the way, and torque each of them to 100 foot-pounds in a crossing pattern. We hope this video helps you out. Brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Please feel free to call us toll-free, 888-844-3393 the company that's here for you on the internet and in person.